Denise, this is what you do. Um, I'm just going to go the long way. But once you log in to the 2008 server, that's what this is. You're going to go start. Okay. Uh, all programs. Accessories. Uh, remote desktop connection. What you might want to do is put a shortcut down here. You'll go into the SBDC2 server. You won't have anything, so you'll have to type that in there. Click connect. That'll ask you to log on with your ID and password. Of course, I've got to type it right. All right, so then now this will be a 2003 domain controller, so you can go into, again, um, administrative tools, active directories and computers, and add the users like you normally do. That, that'll look familiar, right? But let me show you what I was talking about. Like when I look at, um, okay, like here's Jen, here's Jen, right? If we look at her, and her, um, all this information is the same, but if you look at her profile, you'll see that it's pointing to the old server and the share name that created. That's what you're going to have to do and put in the appropriate login bat file to run. All right. Then what you want to do is you, from here, you can remote desktop over, going the same way, accessories, remote desktop, uh, sorry, accessibility, I mean communications, I'm sorry, remote desktop connection. And from there, you can go into this server here, okay. Hopefully I type my password right, which I did. And then you could create the shares. Now I didn't maximize my window because it just makes it a little easier. I know that I have the 2003 new server here and then the 2000 server here. And um, and then I, you know I can go into my folder structure here and add this. So hopefully that'll help out. All right, and um, you'll be able to add the accounts. Uh, the one other thing you'll need to do is to add. All the printers will not work. You need to remove them and add them. Okay. Uh, the way to add them is once you like say log on to the computer. Say this is the computer in, um, well, let me log off out of here. Don't close the machines. Make sure you log out. Don't just click on here. Let it log out and close the window by itself. Okay, then close here, and I'll close this off. So we're in this server here. So say this is the computer, right, in a computer room. What you want to do is go into run and just do slash slash. Um, this should work sbdc1 slash hit enter it'll return and here's all the printers and just click right click on it and say connect and install reinstall the printers you're going to have to reinstall all the printers in the lab and Angela and Jen whoever else and eventually Tom's going to add the new the two Ricos okay so if you have any questions give me a call over the weekend um, I'll be in Jersey Sunday morning but I'll be back Sunday afternoon uh, thanks